Hey everyone, Jonathan Allen here once again from Camp RV in Stratford, Ontario. Uh, today's walkthrough video, we have a 2023. This is a Flagstaff Super Light 26 RBWS. Uh, it's under 30 feet overall length. It's 29 feet, nine inches. It weighs 6,400 pounds dry weight. So it's easily towable by a lot of vehicles. Uh, this is a great floor plan. We got a front queen bedroom. We got a nice big rear bathroom, huge living space in the, in the middle with a, a power slide out. Uh, but we're gonna give you a nice walk around. We'll check out all the features and then we'll head inside as well. Uh, so we'll start at the front here. Huge storage goes right through one side to the other. Uh, you can see it's got a nice big door, lots of room for loading and unloading. Uh, and then those that door, uh, it's held up with a magnet, and then also it's a slam latch, so it just slams shut. Uh, we do have power stabilizer jacks on all four corners, so you got a button here that con controls the two front jacks. We've got another button at the back for the two rear jacks. Um, up at the front here, we have two 30-pound propane tanks with the hard cover with the easy excess hatch on the top. Uh, we've also got dual battery box in behind. All of our new units include filled propane tanks. We also include uh, one deep cycle battery with all of them. Uh, but again, there is room for two, so it is expandable. Um, the Flagstaff Superlights do come standard with a 190 watt solar panel on the roof, uh, and then also a thousand watt inverter. So cool feature about this one. Uh, if you are dry camping somewhere without, without a hydro hookup, you have your dual batteries on the front. Uh, you can create electricity enough to uh, be able to power all your small appliances like your coffee makers and things like that. Uh, we got power tongue jack on the front. So just touch a button goes up and down. There is a light built in on the fronts as well. So if you're hooking up at night, you can see what you're doing. Uh, we got a three quarter molded fiberglass cap with a built in automotive contoured windshield. We've also got a nice LED light strip in behind the, or underneath there. And then we do have our LED marker lights up at the top. Diamond plating down below the cap here prevents stone chips when you're traveling down the road. Uh, on the off door side here, uh, so it does have two power slide outs. I think I only mentioned one, but uh, you have a wardrobe slide out in the bedroom as well as a nice big living room slide out here. Uh, again, access to storage from this side as well. We've got the switch here for our light on the front cap. Uh, we've got our sewer hookup down below. So there's uh, multiple gray tanks on this model. So you got a gray tank here as well as one at the back for the bathroom. Uh, we do have uh, nice tinted frameless windows all the way around. Uh, so really nice uh, sharp look to them cosmetically from the outside, but also gives you some uh, privacy on the inside with that darker tint to them. Uh, back here, we do have our outside shower. So hot and cold tap with a shower head that pulls out. We got our power hookup back here. We got all our water hookups over here. Uh, so there's an antifreeze inlet. Uh, there's a black tank flusher. You've got your fresh water holding tank. Everything's all accessible right here and a light. So if you're hooking up at night, you can see what, again, see what you're doing. Roof ladder on the back, standard to get up onto the roof for cleaning and servicing. Uh, we got a full size spare tire included. Uh, you got pre-wiring for a backup camera, uh, two inch accessory hitch on the back. So it's great for, uh, uh, bike carriers or cargo carriers. Uh, nice big power awning. It's almost the full length of the trailer. Uh, it comes out eight feet. You've got built-in LED lights on it to brighten up your patio area. Uh, we do also have an outside griddle. So the griddle is brand new in a box here, but it does mount right on the side here. So you can have your outside cooking and you got a nice little side table so you can have all your meats and sauces there when you're cooking. Uh, you've got nitro filled tires. Uh, it is an independent torsion axle suspension. You can see nice aluminum rims, so they have a sharp look to them. And these do come with a tire pressure monitoring system. Uh, so you can see the temperature and pressure of the tires as you're driving. And um, we have that box inside, so I'll show you that as well. Outside TV hookup, so you can mount the TV outside, ties into power and cable. You got outside speakers for the stereo, uh, so you can bug your neighbors if you want. And again, frameless windows all the way around. So you can see the nice, nice looking frameless windows here. We got the upgraded solid steps. So these fold right into the door frame. They are adjustable height wise. And the nice thing about these, is they sit right on the ground. So they're solid. They're not just hanging off the side where then you always get a little bit of bounce when you're going up and down them. Uh, nice big entry assist handle beside the door. So you got something to grab onto when you're going in and out. Uh, you do have a screen door, which will separate from your main door. Uh, and then there's a window built into the door with a built in shade system. Uh, but everything else is on the inside, so come on in. Uh, so nice big open living area. Uh, we do have nice theater seating. So the theater seating, first of all, you got the armrest and the cup holders, those flip up. Um, but then you got cup holders and you've got power here, so USB and power outlets. 
Uh, these are built-in recliners, again, because it's theater seating. Uh, so with those, they will recline out. And then you have power lumbar support in there as well. There is storage in the little side holders, or sorry, the armrest here as well. Across from your theater seating, you do, do have your entertainment area. Uh, so you got storage up above, and then you've got your TV, sound bar, and then electric fireplace down below. Um, back to our theater seating, you do have some nice overhead cabinets there. You do have some reading lights here as well. Again, some more USB ports built in. Uh, the dinette will drop down into an extra bed. You do have drawers for storage down below. Uh, and then nice big window beside the dinette. All the windows do have the uh, roll down shade. And those are a slow rise, so you can just let them go. They ride right back up. Uh, outside, I mentioned that tire pressure monitoring system. So again, comes with a screen, goes in your vehicle. Again, tells you the temperature and pressure of tires as you're traveling. Uh, across from our dinette, we have our kitchen area. So first of all, really cool feature. You got a detachable countertop extension. Uh, so it just gives you some extra counter space. But then with that, that'll just pop right off. And then you've got access to all your extra storage there as well. So in here, we've got good drawer storage. Again, more storage down below that. Cabinets up above for storage. So again, quite a bit of storage in this model. You can see a fair amount of counter space here. We got the sink covers. So when you're not using the sinks, you got extra counter space to work with, but they are the nice big stainless steel sinks. Uh, you get a three burner stove with a flush mount cover. Also has the built-in oven down below and the oven does have light built in and you can see the nice accessory knobs with the lighting. Uh, you do get the built-in microwave up above and then a nice big 11 cubic foot 12 volt fridge. So lots of room in there and then there is a travel lock on that fridge so it doesn't fly open when you're traveling. Uh, air conditioning is ducted through the ceiling. Uh, the heat is vented through the floor. Uh, we've also got the extra fan in the kitchen area with a built-in. So with these it's got built-in fan and then a vent cover up over top so you can leave it open when it's raining. Uh, we've got the queen bedroom up at the front. So again, I did mention it's got the second slide. So you've got wardrobe cabinet here. So lots of room for hanging clothes as well as some folded clothes here. Uh, we do have some storage down in the drawers down below the bed here too. Uh, that bed will lift up for some extra storage. And you can see all welded aluminum framing. That's how this entire coach is built. There's no wood framing anywhere other than your cabinetry. Uh, and then so beside the bed, you can see you got power outlets and USB ports on both sides. You got that nice big window at the head of the bed with a pull down shade in front of it. Uh, you get overhead cabinets up above. And again, another power fan with a roof vent cover in the bedroom. And we did order this one with a bedroom TV. So the TV does angle. And then you do have a pocket door here. So you can close that off completely to give yourself privacy if you did have some guests staying with you. Um, all the lighting is LED, so it's nice and bright, very energy efficient. Uh, you got a nice linoleum floor all the way through that's got that hardwood look. Uh, so at the back of the trailer, we do have a nice big bathroom. Uh, so you can see you got the foot flush toilet. You got good storage back here as well. Some more storage underneath the vanity. Uh, you got a medicine cabinet up above the vanity. Uh, a little bit of counter space to work with here. And then a nice big shower. So it is a full stand-up shower. You got uh, the skylight in the ceiling here for extra headroom and as well as some natural light. Uh, again, there is a fair amount of space in here. And then the sliding glass doors, so it keeps everything from getting wet out there. Uh, the other thing that I'll show you is we do have a nice big pantry. Right when you walk in the door, a uh, great spot that you can hang jackets, lots of storage there, and you could use that for pretty much anything if you want to have towels at one spot and food at the other. Uh, so again, this is the 2023 Flagstaff Super Light. It's a 26 RBWS. Uh, it's less than 6,500 pounds. It's less than 30 feet overall on the outside. Uh, we have it in stock at Camping RV in Stratford. Give us a call today to book your appointment and happy camping.